I am uh, happy and pleased to know that after a long process of uh, preparations, uh, we are now finally approaching the uh, realization of the African standby force. The aim of the Amani Africa 2 field training exercise is to evaluate the ability of the Africa Union to mandate, deploy, manage, sustain and recover a rapid deployment capability and expand the deployment into an Africa Union mission. The exercise will enable us to evaluate whether the African standby force has achieved full operational capability. It is the first ever field exercise undertaken by the Africa Union at the continental level. And I am happy to note that the, all the regional economic community and regional mechanisms, including the regional the five brigades are part of this exercise. This really underlines the fact that this is a continental exercise. And I, I want to take and size this opportunity to thank SADC and South Africa for inviting this exercise and making it happen by providing all the necessary preparations and means to, uh, to support the exercise. You will notice also that uh, during this exercise we, uh, we have opened to the collaboration of partners and I would like also to uh, once again express our gratitude and, and thanks to the European Union who has been with us uh, for the uh, preparation and realization of this exercise. Indeed, we feel that the peace is indivisible. And if we realize peace in Africa, it, it, it is a contribution to peace in the, in the, uh, in the world. And that's why we, we, uh, we strongly believe in the uh, collaboration and partnership with UN and all our partners to uh, achieve this goal of silencing the guns and promoting peace and security in the continent.